All right, hi there friends and thanks for joining me. This is a short little video just announcing uh, some events that are coming up and some things that you might be interested in joining or participating in uh, as best you can. If you can't, that's of course okay. Um, the first thing I want to say though is just to thank everyone who uh, makes this channel possible, all my viewers, all the people who watch the videos and provide comments. I, I learn from you, hopefully, I think, just as much as you learn from me. I think that's great. Um, I am truly blessed to be doing what I love in that I love geology and I love education and being able to have this extra outlet outside of uh, college teaching has been a great way for me to connect with folks. Also becomes a really good resource that uh, my students can use. So I feel like it's just win, win, win. And so I just want to uh, show my appreciation to those uh, that have supported the channel, that make it possible, uh, comments, emails, things that uh, back and forth that we've had together that really uh, helps me improve as a geologic educator. Um, the channel keeps growing on its own, so that's a good sign. So it's getting out to those folks who are interested. So so the big announcement here is I've had requests from folks to host some field trips or, or do something in that vein. And so I've thought long and hard about it. And I think the first thing I want to do is just do something fairly small and local uh, and then kind of just see how it goes and take it from there. And so I thought I would host uh, a, two different field trip days here in October. Uh, in my area here in South Central Idaho around Twin Falls to those that might be interested. And it would be a combination of places that maybe I've showcased in videos, but maybe some new places as well. And definitely I think the, the highlight is always being there yourself, right? I mean, the videos are a good way to bring that field trip component to you, but nothing really replicates actually being uh, in the field on your own, touching the rocks, being able to kind of take in that multi-sensory experience. And so these are the two days I've selected, a, a Thursday and a Friday in October. Generally, the weather is pretty good here in southern Idaho that time of year. It's maybe light jacket weather. It can be a little breezy, uh, but hopefully it'll be dry. I don't think it'll be snowy and cold. That's usually not what's happening that time of year. Uh, and sometimes it's, you know, 75 degrees and sunny so we'll just kind of see how it goes um, so just some more details on this um, I'm thinking I'd probably want to cap it around 30 or so people per day just to kind of keep it manageable for myself and not let it get too crazy um, at least this first go round um, just a so suggested donation amount just something to help cover uh, my time and some of the prep work that I'll put into that. Um, to, again, just a suggestion. Uh, my email address is there. And um, if you can let me know if you're interested or maybe you decide right now, holy cow, I'm going to be there no matter what. Uh, let me know. And then I'll probably be putting together some of the uh, more details on the logistics as we go. In terms of where we're going to go, I think I've settled on uh, a close to Twin Falls day one, uh, the Snake River Canyon, Shoshone Falls, Auger Falls, uh, the Bonneville flood evidence right here locally. There's a lot to see and do uh, just here around Twin Falls. And then the second day would be heading a little bit south, looking at some of the uh, volcanic rocks associated with the Yellowstone uh, super volcano when it was here in Twin Falls, um, uh, Balanced Rock, which has some neat geology as well and then working our way up into the Hagerman area where there's great evidence of not just the Bonneville flood uh, but pa paleo um, uh, volcanic events water lava interaction there's a modern landslide there's some other things the aquifer the snake river plain aquifer is a big part of that story as well uh, and so working our way up into that area and so um, that's kind of the idea I have right now I think people can just figure out their own logistics instead of in, in terms of where they're staying and uh, lodging uh, we can do some sort of carpool slash car caravan um, where folks can share rides maybe so we're not taking uh, 30 vehicles out in the field each day uh, we'll have a meeting spot that sort of thing um, maybe I could add in like we could maybe do a group dinner on Thursday night or Friday night uh, if that's of interest to people so we'll just kind of see how it goes this is uh, branching out trying something new um, I've met a few of you just people stopping through town or in other ways and I've emailed some folks and uh, I think it'd be a fun way for me to get to know some of the people that right now just exist in friendly emails and, and kind comments and so whoops my light just went out there we go 
um, well, it's off now. Anyway, um, so there's that. And then the other one to make you aware of if you didn't hear about it the first time, and we're still working on the details for this, but um, in a couple summers from now, it's about two years from now, um, putting together a Grand Canyon trip with Western River Expedition. So the idea is that I would be on that trip um, providing geologic information. The guides would take care of food and keeping you safe and um, that sort of thing. And I'll have more information on that as we go. Um, and I think we should get dates on that sometime in October. So hopefully that's of interest to folks as well. I'd, I'd love to see um, us get that trip filled with some YouTube fans and some people interested in spending some time with me in the Grand Canyon, which is one of the, you know, holy Mecca geologic pilgrimage sites out there, I would say. Just there's so much to take in, and it's just so, so amazing and spectacular. Um, otherwise, just look for some more videos coming down the pipe. I just finished up a trip to Northern California and Central Oregon, mainly in the Cascades. And so I've got probably another seven, eight, plus videos uh, that I'll put together and, and and launch out there, post for you folks in the coming weeks. Uh, and then I have in a couple weeks, I'll be heading to southwestern Wyoming and parts of eastern Utah, the Uinta Mountains near Vernal, Dinosaur National Monument, um, doing some more videos in that area of the country of the western U.S. So look for some of those things. And as always, feel free to contact me if you have questions or suggestions. Um, I appreciate all the, the donations, the, the support that helps me get out to these places, um, provide a little bit of gas money, that sort of thing. And so thanks so much. Hopefully you can join me for those field trips in October uh, and or the one in the Grand Canyon in summer 2025. So thanks so much for being a part of this YouTube channel and have a great day.